ludicrous status at this point, but how do you kind of balance the, the good feelings from a win with kind of the, uh, do you hold your breath a little bit until you guys get more news on him? Oh, without a doubt, you know, um, don't really know exactly what's going on with him yet. I never got a chance to, uh, to call him, but um, it, was, uh, it was a scary Look alive, y'all. See him go down. Ray and DJ taking over the world. You know, so, all right. so you know, hopefully, hopefully he's going to be all right. Hopefully he'll get him back. Oh, you talking about CP? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Austin out there, I think it was 16 points, 6 assists, plus 29, really took on some more responsibility after Chris went out. What did you see from him out there tonight? What have you seen from him over the course of this season playing alongside him? Uh, he's been playing great. You know, Austin's really doing a great job at um, expanding his game and really just so um, accepting the role of being one of our defenders, being one of our guys who uh, we need to score every night. You know, he's um, he's doing he's doing an awesome job. You know, I'm proud of him. You know, he's he's at that stage where I can say, you know, like it's like a little brother. He's growing up. Yeah. 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 Even though he's a big guy, he's <laughs> Oh yeah, man, that's college, man. You know, I'm 12, 12 years removed from college. You know, I don't even bother that no more. And besides, I didn't play against him. JJ was my enemy. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think so, but I mean, that doesn't really mean anything. You know, those guys are still fresh. We played them on a back-to-back -back last time and they beat us. Um, <clears throat> but I think that tonight, more importantly, we uh, we controlled fast break points. They had like it was thirty to zero last time, and tonight they only had thirteen and second chance points eleven. So I feel like we did a pretty good job defensively tonight, and uh, that set the tone for us. I think we're just clicking, all of us. Everybody's, uh, I feel like it's more defense, um, and, and guys are coming out. Our second unit has been amazing, man. Um, we, we've asked Austin to come in and, and start, and he's been playing well. Ray's playing great on both ends of the floor. Mo is shooting the hell out of the ball and, and taking charges for us, rebounding, Brandon. And, and everybody's just clicking, man. But I think that it all starts with our defense and us just coming out with that mindset of playing hard uh, for 48 minutes. You guys, uh, you guys saw Mo kind of really go for that 10th rebound. <laughs> 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 um, whoa, whoa. <laughs> it seemed like him and Brandon kind of had a little fun thing. They, they sit next to each other like, how do you describe their kind of relationship and what's it like when you see a carryover on the court? Man, when you when you can have fun like that, you win basketball games. That's what it's all about. You know, I think we, that that's when we take it to the next level where we can have fun, but at the same time we're serious about what we're doing out there. You know, because at the same time, if you're having fun but you're serious and you're winning games, I think the sky's the limit for the team. So I mean, stuff like that is always fun. DJ, I mean, you see Mo after a big play. I mean, staring at his hand, he's got like kind of his celebration and stuff. <laughs> yeah, I love Mo. I man, I love I love when my teammates are. Being successful, man. It's 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 cool to see everybody <clears throat> playing well and and just winning. You know, when when you're winning, everything's good. But um, I feel like I'm the one out there shooting threes and taking charges when he's doing it, and when Ray's turning the corner and you know, like you know, what I mean, I, I feel like I'm doing that, man. So it's uh, it's, it's fun to watch. It's fun to be a part of. Ray, uh, at least statistically, that was certainly not the Westbrook that we've, we've seen all year. Uh, how were you able to keep turning him? You know, it, it was definitely a team effort. You know what I'm saying? Can't one person in this league stop him. You know what I'm saying? He's extremely um, athletic. He's, he's a, he has an ultra green light. He's a good player. And, you know, he knows how to get to the basket. He knows how to score. He knows how to finish. But I think collectively as a team, you know, we did a great job. You know, we got a big fella like DJ down there blocking shots and changing shots. It's hard for anybody to score. DJ, I asked Ray about Austin, the way he's come along, but you've spent a few years with him now. What's it been like to see, for you to see the progression he's made, especially with the game he had tonight? It's amazing to see, man. Um, <clears throat> he's starting to come into his own. He's, 
he's you know he's playing well on both sides of the floor, and um, I think it's just confidence, man. Austin works on this game a lot. Uh, he works with JJ a lot. They they shoot a lot, and he's already a really good defensive player. But um, <clears throat> he's just getting older and maturing, man. And it's it, it's fun to watch when you have somebody like that who's who's playing well, and he's also a great guy. How much, uh, DeAndre? How much? Uh, how satisfying to see that. Russell was able to get the goal goals. He wasn't nearly reaching out tonight uh, to see the stat. Well, I mean, he still had 24 points, you know what I mean? But um, I think we just did a pretty good job of loading up to him in transition. And um, as far as him, you know, playmaking, um, whenever guys were going over and loading up because he's such a threat, our weak side was pulled over and we were able to get deflections and steals and just kind of clog up the paint when he gets those easy passes right there to those bigs and guys who, who, who cut for him. But we were, we were all on the string tonight defensively, and that's what helped us. Do you uh, enjoy giving money to charity when you get technical fouls? Did you pick the charity, buddy? Yeah, no, I thought uh, it Doc pick it. Doc's picking it. Yeah, it's probably Doc Rivers' charity. Well, today the PGA of America. <laughs> yeah. Today was was really tough because I didn't think I deserved First that one, but whatever. I'll keep my mouth shut. I'm not gonna be like Travis Kelsey. Oh, you know you know know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, guys, I wanna go. You guys have a great night. JJ.